Hey there, Pisces. It's me, Lex, and I'm here with your general reading. If you have not already, please subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you're notified when I post new content. Keep in mind that this is a general reading, so every bit of this is not going to fit your situation. Take what does and leave the rest for someone else who needs to hear that message. If you would like to contact me directly for any services or products, the link to my website is in the description box below. Two announcements. I am offering a new service, which is Aura Readings. The link for that is in the community tab, as well as the link to sign up for the next community working, which will be a protection ritual you have until August the 11th to sign up for that. All right. So I'm going to do a new spread. Um, I did this yesterday for my Scorpios on my Lex the Scorpion channel. If you have Scorpio in your chart or you know a Scorpio, go ahead and sign up. Um, and subscribe to Lex the Scorpion. That is my um, channel catered specifically to Scorpios. But the, the reading went so well, I decided to use the same spread on this channel for my general reading. So let's get started, Pisces. We're starting with our Life Purpose Oracle. I have strength. Everything you've experienced in your life has made you strong and courageous. I have leadership, take charge of this situation. And I have speaker, your life purpose involves your skills of ordination. Okay. Pisces, what I am feeling is that you need to step into your power. You need to stop allowing yourself and your own thoughts to get in the way and other people to silence you. You have something to say. You are very knowledgeable. You're very wise. You're very skilled and talented. And it's time for you to take charge and to show why you are Pisces. Show people and prove to yourself why you were here, why you're doing this, why you're doing that, whatever that means for you. Um, it could be professional. I feel like a lot of this uh, for most of you, it is going to be in the professional realm, don't be afraid to step up. Don't be afraid to apply for that position. Don't be afraid to ask for a raise. Don't be afraid to offer your input and opinions on different products and uh, uh, projects that are going on at work. And if it's a love situation, don't be afraid to speak up and make your needs known. And don't let anyone, even your partner, make you feel invalidated. OK, your next course of action going forward should be as if I didn't just tell you, but let's see what the tarot says. <laughs> Your next course of action, Pisces, should be Page of Wands, Six of Swords, and the Page of Swords. Sometimes the truth hurts. Sometimes you got to walk away. Sometimes you have to accept a bigger and better offer. And now it's the time for you to do that, whichever is going to fit you. You need to speak your truth and stop holding it in. If it's time for you to quit that job, quit that job and take that other offer. OK, these jobs are not loyal to you. Take that job. If you were stuck in a dead end relationship. And someone else has been after you for years. It might be time to admit to to uh, admit to yourself this shit ain't it, and I need to press on and move to something that's gonna be, you know, a, a better situation for me. Every time I see this, and a lot of tarot readers, they look at the six of swords as moving into better times and better or calmer water, so to speak. Like if it, if you ever seen water during, during a storm like a hurricane or a tropical storm or something like that it's very rocky the waves are crashing the waves are rough and you need to go out to calmer waters if you need to um take a vacation from your job or from your family because your family can drive you nuts if you let them do that and give yourself time to regroup but that is that should be your next course of action okay when it comes to love we're going to pull an advice message for you there When it comes to love, we have healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. That also 
you know, your current family that you've made with yourself and your partner. I have trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith that is clarified with ask your angels and forgiveness. Okay. You cannot build. You cannot grow. You cannot progress. If you are harboring old feelings and old grudges and past hurts. Okay. You need to trust yourself and trust your gut and trust your feelings and do not be afraid to ask for guidance from the divine on how to proceed. Okay. Now closing you out. Um, one thing before I do that, those are my Pisces friends out there who were single. The reason why relationships have not worked out for you in the past is because of your parents, your parents relationship was terrible and you're repeating the same patterns. You need to break that cycle. Okay. All right. And to close you out, we are using our wisdom of the house of night and that is choices. This is the number 46. Four is a number of stability. Six is a number of uh, communication and harmony. Add the two together. That is a 10, which is a number of, of completion. In order for you to complete your this chapter in your life or to complete your purpose, to complete the task at hand, you have to make choices and you have to stand by those choices. Everyone's not going to be happy with your choices and it's not for them to be happy with because you got to be happy with you. It no longer do you put yourself on the back burner and understand also that when you make your choices, they have choices. Do not try to rationalize their choice. They made their choice. Now you have to make yours. I don't know why I'm saying that, but somebody need to hear it the way that I said it. OK, Pisces, that is your message. If this resonates with you, give me a thumbs up, comment below, share it with the fellow Pisces. You feel needs to hear the message to contact me. The link to the website is in the description to sign up for an aura reading or the community protection ritual. Those links are both in the community tab here on YouTube. So until next time, Pisces, love you. Take care.